Guys and girls, welcome to Scene TV. I'm Marcus. We are down at the Propaganda Club today where we are with Josh Wilperio and Matthew Briggs. Now, um, Matthew Briggs is Josh Wilperio's partner, collaborator, producer, director, social media expert. He does everything. Um, Josh Wilperio is the actual uh, cabaret star performer himself who has just come off the Adelaide Cabaret Fringe Festival with Scarred for Life, an amazing show. If you missed it, well, you know what? you missed something huge, it was incredible. Right now though, however, God, I'm getting a lot of words out, aren't I? Right now though, Josh has hit back with an amazing new video, which is an open letter to Malcolm Turnbull, Prime Minister Malcolm Turnbull, called Dear Malcolm Turnbull. Let's find out all about it, boys. Welcome to Scene TV. Hey Marcus, great to be here. So, the video, what inspired it? My utter distraught rage and frustration at the existence of this plebiscite and this was just an outlet for that to help my own mental health for me to express these emotions and um, then I called him up and I said all right is this good because often he tells me that my music's not good oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> until I write something good <laughs> and which happens frequently I'm sure no it doesn't <laughs> like uh, so I called him up and I was like, should I put this out there? And he said, yes, it's good. Which for him is like the biggest compliment that he'll ever give. It's good. Yeah, yeah that's it's like... Good. It's yeah. good. How was dinner tonight, honey? Good. That's like, yeah. oh my yeah. God. Yeah. It's like, oh my God, next level. Yeah. I'm going to go into My Kitchen Rules. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> um, sweet, so how has the video been received? We've just been so overwhelmed and blown away by... The response none of us could have possibly predicted that it would be received like this so we're nudging 200,000 views wonderful we released on Monday and um, and the iTunes popularity is very high um, we've just received we're starting to receive purchases of the song through iTunes and my website and we're starting to raise some money for the cause that we're supporting with this song. And what's the cause? The cause is Q Life. Do you know much about? I do. Q yep. Life? You want to tell everyone? Let's tell everyone Let's else. Tell everyone else. <laughs> uh, so Q Life is Australia's first national counselling service, specifically for LGBTQI plus people, and it started because. If you're an LGBTQI plus person and you need counselling and you ring a hotline, often the person on the other end of the hotline doesn't have your particular life experience or something similar to your life experience and you have to spend half the call explaining, okay, this is what it's like to grow up gay or this is what it's like to grow up trans or bi and, and it, it, that's, um, that can make it difficult to receive the kind of immediate counselling care that you need. So Q Life was started for to fill that exact gap, and they're just doing fantastic things, and they could not be more essential at this particular point in our nation's history, with this plebiscite that we're going through. Uh, and you know, I did this song because we, as queer people, need to feel empowered and need to know that we're strong and we're going to get through this at this particular point in time this i wanted this song to be like almost like our anthem this is an anthem for us and so supporting this cause is just the next natural progression of that and i'm so happy we've we've raised almost a hundred dollars through our website already that is brilliant good uh, work of course thank and you plenty plenty of views yeah yeah <laughs> yeah um, so, uh, what, uh, so, uh, you know, lyrically, I mean, the lyrics are really clever, you guys. Thank I you. mean, at the end of this video, we'll show you the, um, the actual video itself. Um, lyrically, just outstanding, musically. <laughs> I mean, you're, you're a master on the piano, aren't you? But, um, so what really, ha, ha, when you sit down and write something like this, um, how do you find the inspiration? Where does it all come from? Right. So, all you have to do to write a song, in my opinion, a cabaret or musical theatre song, is be honest and be specific. Okay? So I, my inspiration, of course, was my feelings of being distraught, my feelings of being angry, of, of injustice of this situation and how this person, how this person can, how can this person do this? You know, how can, 
how can um, Sorry, I got thrown. <laughs> I know. Sorry, there's a bit of action offset. It's all good. Um, sorry, go on. So, um, before, do you know what you're up to? Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> in, in, but yeah, in short, um, so I found th those emotions, and then to to let them out, you've just got to be write what you know, be honest, tell him exactly what I think of him and tell it in a really specific way. So instead of saying, you know, I'm really angry and upset and, and um, you know, this is wrong, I, I go through exactly, yeah, just being really specific. All the points, all the facts. Yeah. Now, when of course the a marriage equality happens, and it will, yes. um, is there gonna be a proposal? <laughs> We can't Come on, on camera, here. guys. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, a bit soon. That's way too soon. No, we're never going to get married. <laughs> <laughs> no, we can use lack of marriage equality as an excuse. I know, stage. right? Exactly, yeah. <laughs> it's great. No, it's not. It's terrible. Putting you guys on the spot. Putting you on the spot. Guys, what an absolute pleasure having you on set here today. Um, I cannot wait to see what happens with this video. I cannot wait to see what happens with this plebiscite. Um, thank you so much for your time. Matthew. Thank you. Thank you. Josh, thank you, Marcus. Thank you. All the best. Thank Exciting you. Exciting times. Guys, stay uh, watching Scene TV. We're going to show you the YouTube video right now and we'll see you soon for more. Cheers.